Lions made sure to greet him below. A man who appears to have fallen accidentally into a lion enclosure. Allegedly! Seen in the beginning of this heart racing clip. Hey, hey, I ain't gonna lie. See, somebody like me, I'd have been throwing rocks at the uh, at the lion to piss him off. <laughs> I bet you won't fall on the cage no more. Yo, what's going on, everybody, man? This your boy, Dad. Today, I'm bringing y'all another reaction video. Now, this video is called Six Lions Encounters That Will Give You Chills, Part 6. Now, look, if y'all new to this channel, y'all make sure you hit that like, y'all comment, and subscribe. Things of that nature. With that being said, let's go and hop directly into it. Remember, we got to close our eyes when the video first starts. We can't watch the previews. We need, we need to be shocked and chill and bona fide. Let's go and hop directly into it. These six terrifying close your eyes. encounters close, will close surely your eyes. give you nightmares that will last for days to come. Number Dang. six. Right, what was supposed to be a fun honeymoon trip quickly turned for the worse after a scary encounter. Oh, with lions oh, in Cardiga, boy, hold on, South man. Africa. Hey, look, this come on. terrifying encounter begins with one of the tourists recording a pride of lions relaxing and laying down in a patch of grass. Uh, each of them. Yay. <laughs> oh, you over messing with his female. That's what it is. Hey! After a while, one of the male lions does something extremely oh, man, petrifying, forcing the group to run quickly. What the male do? I'll start the engine now. Why the hell y'all in the car with, with glass and protected and all that anyway? The predator does not stop pursuing the group as it eventually gets closer and closer, scaring everyone in the jeep. Hey, they better than me. I ain't gonna lie, cause I, I woulda hopped out out the truck. I woulda hit that line with that. Make it, make it, make it, make it. What's that? <laughs> What's that TikTok sound? I didn't hear. I'm telling you. Luckily, the lion loses interest and decides to run past the group, ending the chase. Number five. I believe this I believe unlucky. animals be scaring people just because they can. Cause, bro, you could have killed them then. The camper went through a real-life nightmare after he saw two large and hungry lions right outside his tent. The clip starts off intensely as it shows a camper inside his tent attempting to scare off the two large predators trying to make him their dinner. I hope that tent made out of Teflon because they, they start. They, oh, oh, there you go. The Hop animals on. keep harassing Hop, by poking oh, my bad. the tent with their sharp claws and getting their faces in front of the tent door. I apologize. I'm yelling at everybody here just trying to watch the video. What are you finna die? Despite it being the only thing keeping the lions from reaching him, the man repeatedly opens the tent door, taunting Why? the predators even more. I told you, they got claws strong enough. They better be mad at Teflon. Teflon and done. The lions eventually leave him alone, enabling him to go outside and escape. Number four. This a group of she, she went out somewhere got the and experience of a lifetime after a hike went wrong in the Pandoro Game Lodge Great Kruger National Park. In the beginning, a group of tourists can be seen following the tracks of a lion in an attempt to get a closer look at the predator. After a while, they see eventually me. find the lion, which proceeds to do something horrifying, leaving the group shaking in fear. After threatening the group, the animal then decides to retreat and walk back towards the cover of the bush surrounding them and walk back to the cover of the bush. Oh, scary ass lion. Hey, man, you charge him. Supposed to be king of the... First of all, lions don't even stay in jungle. Yeah, that's unfortunately nobody Number got three. 
British tourist Steve Haley was met with an unexpected roadblock during his trip in the Kruger National Park in South Africa. The start of the clip shows Steve Haley recording a pride of large lions casually walking in the road, causing a terrifying yet once-in-a-lifetime roadblock experience. I bet you won't uh, pull a speed go through. I hope you in a car. It look like you on a bike. Despite this, Steve remains extremely calm, even as the enormous predators get closer and closer, slowly shaving the distance separating them. Buddy ain't scared of nothing. Is this stuff still recording? Because it, it, it like to mess up a lot. The pride eventually gets uncomfortably close to his car, the video showing nothing but the car protecting his safety. Ooh. But I know you ain't rolling down the window. Oh, he rolled it up. That was a bit too close. The lions then walk past his car. It's the first time I ever seen an ad it. on this channel. Hello, I said ding. Airbag guy can't do it all. Ding, ding, ding. What's the matter? Leaving no one harmed. Number two. A camper in Bejane, South Africa, experienced firsthand how it feels living close to the dangerous and gigantic carnivores of Africa. This adrenaline pumping clip starts off with a man recording a mating pair of lions locking the pathwalk of his camp. Whoa, whoa, whoa. did you say mating? Okay, you guys can then walk through our house. Why they got some big nuts on him? You're definitely going to walk through our house now, aren't you? He's going through he your house. goes on to explain how grabbing a coffee could cost him his life due to the carnivores always blocking the way every single day. Okay. There's the female. The male's looking for the female. She's just walked through our dining room. The video then cuts to the same man boiling some water with a large male lion watching him from outside while also attempting to scare the camper by doing Hey, that boy this. told you, you scared to come outside. Go outside, man. He ain't gonna do nothing to you. That's all the, that's all the flex, brother. I've seen on Discovery Channel, they do that to try to scare you. When they go outside, they're gonna run away. The clip ends with him showing a group watching the whole thing from afar. Number one. A zoo trip quickly turned grim after a man fell into an enclosure where a pair of male I'm gonna let you know right now. I don't I don't care. Um whatever happens to him, I I hope he um how do I say this? I don't hope he died, but I hope they do some things to him, the lions. Because how do you accidentally fall into a lion's cage? The last time I've been to the zoo, I went to the tiger cage and the tiger cage the, the cage itself stood up 13, 14 feet. Okay, when I saw the lions, it's like you don't accidentally fall into no cage. So if you fall in there and whatever happened to you, I don't feel bad for you. And if and you die, they better not put them animals down. Like, they just did what they were supposed to do. And don't act like, I ain't, see, I, I'm going to get political. I ain't even going to say, don't even act like, well, it shocked the kids. There's a lot more other stuff that's going on right now. They can shock them kids, but let's start from And female lions made sure to greet him below. A man who appears to have fallen accidentally into a lion enclosure. Yeah, allegedly. Seen in the beginning of this heart racing clip. Hey, hey, I ain't gonna lie. See, somebody like me, I'd have been throwing rocks at the uh, at the lion to piss him off. <laughs> I bet you won't fall in the cage no more. <laughs> the crowd screams in fear and terror while the man attempts to scare the large predators trying to get closer to examine him. Come on, Nala. Pounce on him. No, throw the rocks at, at the lions, man. Piss them off. The large predators continue to approach him despite his best efforts to make himself look as big and terrifying as possible with the hopes of scaring the lions away. Throw rocks at the lions! Piss them all! 
Miraculously, both lions lose interest in the man, giving him time to safely escape. Thanks for watching until the end. Check. Look, man, that's in this video. Y'all like to enjoy it. Anything in the nature. Y'all make sure I leave a like, y'all come and subscribe. And with that being said, I'm going to holler at y'all later.